the angels, tell the angels I'm on my way to glory up there, up there. And I tell a story, tell the angels, the angels just to make more room, tell the angels. I'll be there soon, tell the angels, angels, I'm on my way, and I'll be up there to stay, my road is rough and rocky, and my cross so heavy to bear, and my friends, they talk about me, and I can't find peace anywhere And I'm tired, I'm weary, I'm sick and sad My heart is heavy laid in and I'm feeling bad I know someday I'm going away And I'm going up to heaven to stay Just tell the angel I'm on my way to tell the angel And I'll be there soon Tell the angel Angels, I'm on my way to glory Up there and up there And i tell a story Tell the angel Just to make more room Tell the angel I'll be there soon Tell the angel Angels, I'm on my way and I'll be up there to stay. My road is rough and rocky and my cross so heavy to bear. And my friends, they talk about me and I can't find peace anywhere. I'm tired, I'm weary, I'm sick and sad. My heart is heavy, let it in, I'm feeling bad. I know someday I'm going away, and I'm going up to heaven to stay, to tell the angel. I'm on my way, to tell the angel. I'll be there soon, tell the angel I'm on my way and I'll be up there to stay Tell the angel, tell the angel Just make more room, tell the angel I'll be there soon, tell the angel I'm on my way to glory up there and up there And I tell a story, tell the angel Just make no room, tell the angel And I'll be there soon, tell the angel Rangers, I'm on my way And I'll be up there to stay the 23rd chapter and verse 27 and also in the Old Testament the book of Isaiah uh, chapter 1 and verse 18 Matthew 23 and verse 27 says woe unto you strives and Pharisees hypocrites for ye are like unto whitened sculptures of that which indeed appear beautiful outward, but are within full of dead men's bones and of all uncleanness. Woe unto you, strives and Pharisees, hypocrites, for ye are like unto white sculptures, uh, which indeed appear beautiful outward but are within full of dead men's bones and of all uncleanliness. In the book of Isaiah, the first chapter in verse 18, these words are found, say, Come now and let us reason together, said the Lord, though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white 
as snow, and though they be red like chrism, they shall be as wool. Come now, let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. Though they be red like chrism, they shall be as wool. I want to talk this evening for a short while from this thought. Are you whitewashed or are you washed white? Are you whitewashed or are you washed white? Now, there are some of you uh, who came up in the rural may remember uh, when as poor people you didn't know a whole lot, didn't know much about paint. To, to poor people especially, because of small incomes and many, many of our folk parents, our fathers and grandfathers had a method that they would use to brighten up things, uh, to brighten up the house, um, the fence, uh, the woodshed, the barn, the, the hen house, the, the outhouse uh, with a substance called whitewash. Uh, yes, uh, some, some of you remember, it, it, it was a, whitewash was a mixture of lime and powdered chalk and water. It was used to impress the outward appearance of a surface. It, it, was, it, was, it really done nothing for the inside of the wall or the fence. It, it, it didn't treat it in no kind of way. All it did was to make it look good on the outside. And, uh, you, it would just make it look good on the outside, and those who would pass by would admire its beauty, its cleanness, and its brightness. And, and as long as the sun shines and the weather is dry, whitewash looks good. Uh, but whenever a heavy rain or storm comes, it will lose its glow. Uh, the same can be said about some whitewash Christians. Uh, oh, they are beautiful on the outward, and we think they are born again, God fearing, peace loving Christians uh, as long as the sun is shining. Uh, uh, they can hold a position. Uh, their name is being called. Things are going the way that they wanted to go. They will sparkle, glitter, glow, and shine. And as long as the skies are blue. Um, uh, as long as they can kick folk around, they, they'll shine and they'll look good. But, but, but their appearance, my brothers and sisters, is only temporarily. Because they are whitewashed. And some whitewashed Christians can shine for a long time. And, uh, folk think that, that they, they are real. And they, they think that they have been born again. But, but sooner or later, their real identity will come out. I don't care. You can fool some of the folks some of the time, but you can't fool God no time. And I found out whoever you are on the inside will eventually show up on the outside. My brothers and sisters, Jesus was talking to some Pharisees and he used whitewash. He used... Uh, as the term to describe them, uh, although Jesus was kind, 
he was compassionate. He was loving, holy, humble. He was meek and mild. But yet, he never did hesitate in telling the truth. He called sin, sin. He called the Pharisees hypocrites. You, you, you are like tombs covered with whitewash. Now, uh, so, so it is with you. So, some of you appear to be honest men on the outside, but you are hypocrites. Uh, you, you, you are liars. Uh, 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 Jesus called a spade a spade. He, he didn't bite his tongue about telling folk where they stood. Let us take a closer look at the Pharisee religion. It, it, it was characterized by an outward glow. Uh, but it was manners, the inward glow. Uh, it, it, it was strong on quantity, but it was weak in quality. It, it was high on words, uh, but it was uh, low in deeds. Uh, it was long in talk, but it was short in action. It, 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 was, it, it was obeyed to the latter of law, but it was neglected by the spirit of the law. Uh, this is Pharisee religion. I, I tell you, it, it was it, it was an outward, it was an outward religion. Pharisees they honored God with their mouth and with their lips, but their hearts were far from God. You know, although they didn't steal and, and material goods, yet they robbed people of their reputations. And, Yes, they weren't murderers and killers in the usual sense, but 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 they indulged in character assassination. They weren't adulterers by participation, but by uh, imagination and aspiration. Jesus said, "If you're thinking in your heart, in your mind, you are guilty." They, they, they didn't tell lies, but they lived a lie. They didn't have no love. They didn't love. Uh, so they pretended to be one thing when in reality they were really something else. Um, that, that's why Christ referred to them as being whitewashed. And yes, uh, you know, but centuries before the Pharisees of Christ's appearance and Isaiah spoke concerning a inward whiteness, not an outward look, but 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 an in-house cleaning that would purge one's sins away and make one fit for the service of the Lord. Isaiah, he writes, he said, "Come now." Come, let us reason together. Though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. Though they be red as crimson, they shall be as wool. Yes, my brothers and sisters, Isaiah talks of a cleaning process that starts on the inside. And I tell you, God can wash us so thoroughly that your sins become as white as snow. Notice, he said, though your sins be as scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. And I tell you, when God cleans you, he's as white as snow. Not off white, but uh, snow white. Not cream colored, uh, but cotton white. Not speckled white, but pure white. And yes, uh, he says God's cleaning process uh, is not like whitewash. 
Yes. Uh, in other words, when God cleans you, you will be clean from the inside out. Um, and, and for those of you that may be listening or may be looking this evening, uh, for those of you that are whitewashed, um, for those of you uh, that may be have been tending uh, that you're really clean. I know a man, uh, yes, um, he can show up, uh, clean you for real. Um, yes, you see, whitewash uh, will only last uh, while the sun is shining. Uh, whitewash uh, will only last uh, while the rain uh, is not falling. Uh, but uh, whitewash uh, when it rains or uh, uh, when it storms, uh, whitewash uh, will lose uh, its glitter uh, and its glow. Uh, but I know somebody uh, this evening. Uh, yes, uh, I know a man uh, who established uh, his laundry uh, a long uh, time ago. Uh, he established it uh, out on a hill uh, called Calvary. Uh, yes, uh, he opened his laundry uh, of the cleaning business uh, and he, he paid a price uh, for a business license. Uh, yes, because uh, Jesus died. Uh, blood uh, came screaming down. Uh, yes, uh, he died uh, on a hill uh, called uh, Calvary. Uh, yes, uh, he died uh, establishing uh, his laundry, uh, his cleaning uh, process. Uh, yes, uh, and he specializes uh, in washing uh, and cleansing uh, dirty hearts uh, and filthy minds. Uh, his blood uh, is the spiritual uh, detergent. Uh, yes, uh, I know you look at TV and uh, you've seen uh, great commercials. Uh, they used to talk about Tide takes out stains uh, others leave behind. Uh, but I tell you uh, Tide can't wash uh, away uh, your sins. Uh, I don't care. Uh, Clorox uh, can't wash uh, away your sins. Uh, but I heard the songwriter say nothing, nothing but the blood of Jesus can wash sin away. Yes, and I don't know about you, but I'm glad I ran to that spiritual laundry. One day I came to Jesus just as I was. I was weary. I was worn and I was sad, but I found in him a, a resting place, and he made me glad. Yeah, and I don't know about you, but I tell you this evening, when God clean you up, you'll show enough be clean yeah when God wash your sins they'll show sure enough be clean I used to hear the old folk say since God clean me up things I used to do I don't do no more places I used to go I don't go no more yeah I've got a new walk when God clean you. I don't know about y'all this evening, but oh, I'm glad I've been washed white, and I'm not whitewashed. I've been washed in the blood of the Lamb. There is a, a fountain filled with blood drawn from Emmanuel's vein. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm clean. I got to clean. Jesus paid it all on Calvary. He died. He bowed his head in the locks of his shoulder. He died. One Friday, they hung him high. 
They stretched him wide. He, he bowed his head, locks on his shoulder. But that ain't all. They laid him in a bar of tuna. And all night, Friday night, he was still right there. All day Saturday, he was right there. All night, Saturday night, he was still right there. But I Sunday morning, he got up, got all power, cleaning power, saving power, holding power. Yay! He got power. If you want to be clean, you got to let the Lord clean you. You can't, re you can't reform yourself. You need transforming. And it won't nothing transform you but the blood. The blood. Oh, the blood. The blood of Jesus. It'll save. It'll cleanse. And make you whole. Yeah. 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 nothing but the blood I tell you can clean you. That's why the Bible says salvation can be found in no other name given in heaven and earth than the name of Jesus. And I double dog dare you. I don't care how filthy you think you are. I double dog dare you right now wherever you are to bow down on your knees and call his name and say Jesus say Jesus Lord Lord clean me fix me make me yeah I guarantee you my God will clean you up won't he do it yes he will yeah he'll clean you up I don't care how far you away he can clean you up it won't be whitewashed it won't be for just a little while. Reen, I know I've been washed in the blood of the Lamb. Because when the storm come, when the rain fall, when the storm passes over, I still got joy in my heart. Yeah! God bless you to see. God bless your heart to see. He's so sweet. That he'll clean. Nobody like me, or nobody like me, like you. He will clean you up. He will make you whole. You need this, Jesus. Are you whitewashed? Or are you washed white? And I thank God that he's the kind of God that can wash us white. Make us, clean us, fix us, sin us. Hallelujah. And one day receive us into his kingdom where we'll praise him forevermore. God bless you. God bless your heart this evening. I love him, y'all. I love him. I love him. I love him. Can't nobody. Can't nobody do you like Jesus. Can't nobody clean you up like Jesus. I'm not talking about something I heard. I'm talking about something that Leon Taylor knows. God will clean you up. He'll save you. That's why I love this song. You see, I, I, I can't forget. When I, I was sad, I was sad and dirty and nasty. My head was hanging and hanging down. And my soul 
my soul was feeling bad. Y'all know what? All, all, all I could say. I asked the Lord, Jesus, please take my hand. Y'all know what he did? And Jesus heard, he heard, heard me, and he gave, God gave, he gave me a brand new start, and that's why I like to tell everybody, you know he's sweet, I know, oh yes he is. Oh, he, God, he, he's mighty, mighty sweet, I know. You see, dark clouds may rise, and they will. And strong, strong wind, they may blow. That's all right. I, I, I'll tell the world, yes I will, I'm going to tell it, I got to tell it, wherever God bless me to go, but you're going to tell them, that I, I have found me a safe Savior. And he, he, he's sweet, he's so sweet I don't know. God bless you this evening. Are you whitewashed? Are you washed white? If you're whitewashed, you need to get right with God and get it right now. I'm Brother Leon Taylor. I pray that you have a genuine relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ. I'm not talking about a talked about relationship. I'm talking about a personal relationship with nobody but Jesus. Until next week, it is my prayer. It is my plea that the Lord plant all of our feet on higher ground. Until next week, God bless. And may God help you. I, I, I'll tell the world. Oh, yes, I will. I'm going to tell it, I got to tell it, wherever my God bless me to go. You know what? I, I have found, I have found me a safe Savior. And he, he's sweet, he's so sweet, I know. God bless and may God pray over They were singing steps to Jesus and everything is gonna be alright. Oh, the Holy Ghost you could feel and the sisters they would shout for real.